If you were outside today, you definitely noticed the humidity made its way back into the Midlands in a big way, and that did help to fire up a few thunderstorms for our far eastern communities out towards Manning, Sumter, and down towards Orangeburg, while the rest of us unfortunately did miss out on the rain. But the, the next big thing that we're tracking heading into the weekend and really into the first part of next week is the heat once again going to be building, and it could get dangerously hot with feel like temperatures pushing about 106 to 110 over the next several afternoons. So do get ready for more of that extreme extreme heat and humidity. So let's break those feel like temperatures down over the coming days and let you know what we're talking about. So for tomorrow, we're expecting a feel like temperature of 105, 106 for your Sunday. Monday and Tuesday look like they're going to be the hottest and most humid with feel like temperatures pushing 108 to 109. Might even have to make Monday and Tuesday first lower weather days. And then Wednesday, we're still around 104. So it does look like the next five afternoons, we're going to be tracking well into the triple digit feel like temperatures for most of the Midlands. So just get ready for that heat and humidity outside looking off to the west. You can see we still have a fair bit of cloud cover, but the rain has come to an end, but that has helped to cool some spots down. You can see Camden at 79 degrees. Manning's at 81. Orangeburg's at 74. While we've stayed dry here in Columbia and Newberry, still in the upper 80s to near 90 degrees. And on the satellite radar, you can see as that low was working its way up through the far eastern portion of South Carolina, it did spark off those showers and thunderstorms, but the majority of it kind of stayed in the PD region. We had a few showers across Sumter and Lee County, but those systems come to an end. Still have some cloud cover, but most of this activity now working up into North Carolina. So for the next few hours, just looking at clouds, it's going to be a warm and steamy one. Temperatures slowly falling through the 80s. And then later on tonight, a thunderstorm out there early, but those look to be dying out here pretty soon. 74 for that overnight low. For your Saturday, as mentioned, we heat up quickly. 97 by 3 p.m. with those feel like temperatures into the triple digits. For most of us, we do stay dry with just a mix of sun and clouds through the afternoon. So. For the remainder of tonight, we're dry, a sunny, hot start to our Saturday. You can see those clouds building, maybe a stray shower or two, but you can see most of us seeing feel like temperatures get into those triple digits, so a hot and humid Saturday, and then pretty similar for our Sunday. Start off dry, and then just a one or two isolated showers with feel like temperatures into the triple digits, so a pretty typical summer-like forecast expected over the coming days, but it does look like towards the end of next week, we finally might start to get some better rain Rain chances working in for several days, and that could finally bring some much needed rain to the area as we get towards Thursday, Friday and into next weekend. But in the meantime, we just got dry, hot and humid conditions. So upper 90s with a slim chance for showers this weekend near 100 Monday and Tuesday with those extreme feel like temperatures again might have to make those first alert weather days. And then finally, that slightly better chance for some rain will cool us down into the 80s by next weekend.